Hi there, how are you? I hope you will have a great time with me. First thing first. What this tutorial is all about. This tutorial is about. In text citation. Referencing. I will show you how to use APA style. However if you know the system you will able to use any commonly used referencing style. In this tutorial I will show, using most popular word processing program. Microsoft Word. I will use the version 2013. However rules are the same on 2010, or 2007 version. So, welcome to my tutorial for citation and referencing. When I was in my undergrad, I faced lots of problem on referencing and citation. Most of the time I have to spend my assignment time on citation and referencing. But still. So, let's start. See the bold area? It's a quotation. First we are going to cite at the end of the quotation. Click reference tab. Select your style. I am going to choose APA style. You can choose which one you want. Now, click manage resource from reference tab. Click new, to input a new reference. Select the reference type. I will use book. A box with few black field will appear. Now you have to fill it. I will collect information on the quotation, and I will fill these fields. Try to find all information, however if you don't find it, leave it blank. Click OK. If the new reference is not on the current list, select it from master list. Then click copy to send it to master list. Now, click insert citation from reference tab. Click the citation you want to insert. Remember citation will be inserted where your mouse cursor is. So correctly position it before you insert it. When a reference is a direct quotation, it is important to mention the page number. To do that click on the in-text citation. Then click edit citation. And then input your page number. Click OK. And this is the basics of creating in-text citation. Now I am going to delete it. And show you how to insert an in-text citation at the beginning of the quotation. When you are using in-text citation at the beginning of the quotation you cannot use the author name because you have to use it like this. Capital punishment is defined by Crone wetter than the in-text citation than the quotation. To do that we have to exclude the author name from the in-text citation, and have to manually write the last name of author. Click Insert Citation, then click on the inserted in text citation. Click Edit Citation. Click Exclude Author. Now remember what I said about direct quotation? Yes. You have to insert page number. But some style do not support inserting page number at the beginning of the quotation. So again insert citation at the end of the quotation, then exclude, title, author and year. Then input page number. And you are done. Easy right? Thank you for watching. In the next video I will show how to manage bibliography. Please like the video and subscribe to my channel. Subscribe to my channel.